Hi everyone and welcome to Mango Mari. Today I'm going to make a great recipe. These days are very cold so I got the best meal for this day which is chili. <laughs> so prepare to have a very a spicy meal just made by Mango Mari. So here's all the ingredients. And of course, I gotta go get this main thing, which is meat. <laughs> meat. Okay. Meat. Ooh. This recipe requires a lot of meat, different kind of meat, because you know, it's like melting pot. The more different kind of meat, the better taste. I have one pound of ground beef, one pound of beef stew, one pound of, of ground turkey, and Italian sausage. This is mild, but they have, all depends, it's hot. I like the hot, but I, I guess I grabbed the wrong one, but anyway, it doesn't matter. Scissors. Oh, I need a spoon. Okay. Now, start dumping all the meat, and you also, of course, is mango mari chili in a crock pot. I like slow, very slow. Putting all the meats in there. And now the sausage, cutting about four pieces. You have one sausage. See, one sausage. I usually cut it about four pieces. So. Let's grab it, cut it. One, two, and three and four. And continuously doing it to the all the, all the sausage. <laughs> I love sausage. Oh yes, it's one of my favorite meals. Anything that has sausage, it tastes much better. Now, once the meat are inside, what we do? Mix it up, all the meat together. Now, <clears throat> here's my ingredients. This is a one chopped onion, about four um, garlic, minced garlic, about four cloves. Here's one half a teaspoon of chili. Ooh, that's the spicy one. And here's one of adobe, adobe. This is one spoon. Here's one spoon of garlic, garlic. And here's one quarter of black pepper. Dump it in here. Y there you go. Even it out, even it out. Chili. Mm -hmm. Oh, that smells so good. And garlic. And minced garlic. onion and mix it up now I get uh, this rotel is called chili fixing you put that in there hold on a second let me tell you something There's some stores that you might not find chili fixing this, so you can also you can get replace that with hot rotel. See that diced tomato with chili, and you just add more chili powder. And that's it. That's the same. Just in case you don't find the chili fixing. So now I'm gonna put it, my chili fixing. I'm gonna rinse it out. 
the reason why I rinse always my tap of my my cans is because you don't you never know what is what kind of things goes into the warehouse. So always remember that Coca Cola, anything like this. So I clean it up very well. Look at that. Ooh, it smells like chili already. Ooh, nice. Ooh, oh, it smells so good. It's exciting me, the smell of the spice. And move it. Move it along. It's heavy. Move, move. Now, you see now, it's ready to cook. Oh, how is it simple mango mari chili? Remember, pass it around the recipe because you will never be disappointed. I think the meat already has some some water preserve, I guess. So now we so here it is. If you're gonna cook it, you have two options, low, low and high. If you you see. When you're gonna make it like if you want it too fast, then you cook it in high for uh, for four hours, or for eight hours you put it slow if you want it just to go shabby for a long time. You know that's a very 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 good idea. Some more hours to go shopping. so I put it in slow. <laughs> and when you come home, meals ready. <laughs> just so bad. But anyway. That works for the people who like shopping. If it's the people who doesn't like shopping, do it in quick, fast, mode on four for four hours, or slow for eight. <laughs> and then, uh, just an hour before the, the comeback. If it's eight hours, you go one hour. To do seven hours slow, one hour fast with the last. And never list of beans. Ooh. Guinea beans. So I usually put this kind of beans. It's already mixed, you see? Goya guisadas. You can put any beans you want to, but I, I like this kind. I like because it's already seasoned and it tastes tasty. Mm -hmm. So cook it for four hours. One hour, put it in this in here. So it will be total four hour, five hours if it's fast. Eight hours to seven hours slow, one hour fast with the last hour with two cans of beans. So later I'm gonna show you, okay? So let it cook and I'm done for now. So guess what I'm going to be doing now? You guessed it, I'm going shopping <laughs> because dinner is ready. Hey guys. Now I'm going to get something to do while my chill is cooking. Oops. <laughs> my shoes. Maybe I'm going shopping. Or maybe I'm going to have a drink, a cocktail someplace while I'm waiting. Ooh, beautiful day. Come with me to see what I can do.
I better check on my chili. I bet it's ready. <laughs> I'm hungry after having a few cocktail. Oh yes. Okay, see you in a little bit. Hey, after all my running around, it's time to do my final step of mango mari chili. And it's been cooking for eight hours. Chili fixing sauce. It's a powder. <laughs> it's not a sauce, but it's a powder. But you get the idea. So what I do, like I said, put a little bit at a time and see how spicy and salt, how much sodium do you want in your chili. So I put a little bit, like about a, a, a tablespoon. Ooh, look at how delicioso. Mmm, perfect. It's now been one hour, so it's total eight hours of slow cooking chili. So it's time to eat. So good. Thank you for watching Mango Mari. If you want to see more, please like my video, subscribe to my channel, and invite anybody else <laughs> to my channel. So I would really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And I hope you enjoy my recipe nowadays. So cold, delicioso meal for that cold front that's coming all the time. <laughs> Thank you again. Besitos. Bye bye.